All right, guys, welcome to Boxy Outdoors. It is two days before the Pennsylvania Spring Gobbler opener. I'm here with my daughter, Jess. We're going to uh, try and get one done. Uh, the rain's to move in tomorrow, so we wanted to get this ground blind set up. Um, I'll show you the field that we're in. Um, hopefully we can bring you something, but we're gonna bring you the adventure, whether we get a bird or not. So uh, here's a sneak peek of what we're looking at. All right, guys, uh, if we can get back in here uh, come Friday, uh, we'll get back in here, maybe hopefully roost one. But if not, we'll see you Saturday morning. guys 4 30 in the morning i'm gonna be headed out to uh my daughter's and i'm gonna try and see if we can't get a talkative bird all right guys here it goes all right guys all set up in the blind about 6 a.m just got done owl hooting we could hear a pin drop. As it gets light out here, we'll start maybe making some tree yelps. There's our decoy set up, guys. We got a, a lone hen to the right. We got a breeder with a little Jake. Well guys, I, I just turned the camera off and we heard two gunshots. There, this is a finger of woods and uh, there's another big field on the other side of it. And we thought we had heard a gobble faintly over that in that direction. And we heard two gunshots. Two gunshots might be a good sign that maybe they missed it. Hopefully they work back over this way, maybe. Our only action is two geese flew over, and like I said, that faint gobble, and another hunter shooting. We're going to keep at it. We saw something. We got two deer. We had one behind us snort.
daughter hears something. She don't think it's a turkey, but my death ears uh, can't hear nothing. Calling all geese, calling all geese. All right, guys, uh, we're going to be on the GoPro on our way out. We decided to come over in this wood lot. We threw out a couple calls. We got one gobbled. Uh, we're going to try to find a place to get set up real quick. He gobbled. Buzzer. Oh, yeah, I heard it. It sounded like it was right over there. Could just be the way it was turned when it was gobbling. The only thing I could possibly, the thing I could possibly do is I could go back try to sneak back over to where I we were first standing like right on that path coming into the in the woods and call on, like I'm walking away but I just don't well, what time is it? Ten after eleven. Oh, so we got about fifty minutes. Yeah. Or we to Or we could just sit here and just See if he comes in. Just stay quiet now. See, this is where I feel I might be trying to overcall, trying to hear that bird. It would be nice to hear him gobble back one more time. These get wet, they're done. Yeah. So I'm trying to keep it covered. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, we had a little excitement right there. Um, I'm hoping the GoPro was able to pick up some of that goblin that we heard. Um, we just went over to another like wood lot. Figured we'd try it right before we left, and uh, he double gobbled, and then I didn't hear it. 
called again. He double gobbled. I thought I heard it. And then, uh, as you saw, I, I told you guys that we had, had a bird going. And then he gobbled again. And I heard that time. And uh, we got set up. And um, for whatever reason, they went silent. We sat there for about, what, 45 minutes? Yeah. Um, we got five minutes till close. So I'm going to send you over to our outro that we did a little in a uh, little bit too soon but uh we'll talk about what happened this morning and uh, you just saw what happened today uh, this afternoon so all right guys go see this uh outro well guys there wasn't a whole lot to show here today um the rain's starting to kind of move back in um heard some gobbles early on those shots Probably about two, three hundred yards from us. A um, little bit later, we heard a shot down across the road. Heard some hens. Never did see them. They never come to the field. And then uh, we heard about one more gobble. Yeah. And uh, but nothing materialized. So a lot of geese. <laughs> and we had one uh, blue herring that kept flying over. That's how it rules. The turkey win this time. We'll get back after him. As always, guys, have yourself a blessed day. Remember, get out there. Share that passion.